Hi, my name is Dr. James Woodson, founder and CEO of Pulsera. Thanks for joining us today. Today we're going to show you how you can leverage our communication platform to connect care teams. So we're going to look at a STEMI case that starts in the field with EMS, but keep in mind you can start a case by any method of arrival, including interfacility transfers. So when we look at a demo, we want to show you three basic steps that will help you understand how to leverage Pulsera. So step one is you create a dedicated patient channel. Step two, you can dynamically build your care team. And then step three, you communicate. It's that simple. A first responder or medic can create a dedicated patient channel by simply entering the patient name. Before starting to add the care team, it's important to add enough information so EMS crews can replace the traditional verbal report. Typically, medics add some basic demographics like date of birth, age, and gender. To simplify the report, Pulsera also leverages multimedia functionality included in your average smartphone. For example, instead of a medic calling the emergency department and waiting for someone to pick up the line, they can quickly dictate their report as an audio clip. They can also use the camera to add images of the patient, the ECG, a monitor, a medication list, or even an ID like a driver's license or insurance card to assist with pre-registration. The medic may also take advantage of one of our integrations to pull the ECG from the cloud as demonstrated here. The key difference in a traditional radio report and a Pulsera 1 report is all downstream team members now have access to the critical information. This can even replace the short form in many locations. The next step is to build your care team. In the case demonstrated here, the medic has already selected the destination facility, so they simply tap alert. The receiving hospital can easily customize who receives this initial alert. In this example, the charge nurse, emergency physician, and registration receive the initial notification. This allows registration to pre-register the patient in the emergency department the opportunity to decide if they want to fully activate their STEMI team. This flexibility can help prevent false activations. EMS receives a notification that the hospital is aware of the critical inbound STEMI patient as well as confirmation the ECG has been received. Pulsera assists with STEMI and doubt workflows to help protect utilization of expensive resources. When the hospital is ready to activate their full STEMI team, they can do so with a single tap. Again, this care team is fully customizable to hospital resources and preferences. Finally, if at any point during the patient's care, a clinician needs to add additional team members, they can do so with a tap. An example might be adding an additional team member like a house supervisor as demonstrated here, or in the rare case you need anesthesia for assistance in intubating a deteriorating patient, or even adding a new interfacility consult or transfer request. One of the things that makes Pulsera so unique is that the entire care team is visible. This includes individuals at your organization as well as EMS providers and individuals that might be located at other organizations using Pulsera for transfer or consult purposes. In addition, timestamps are recorded when individuals acknowledge their alerts and all team members can see who has confirmed their alerts and is actively participating in this patient's care. Not only can clinicians identify and continue to update the team, but with a tap, they can launch a live audio or video call. To illustrate some care coordination and enhanced workflow opportunities, let's get back to our STEMI patient who is still with EMS in transit to the hospital. Most centers try to bypass the emergency department and take the patient directly to the cath lab to save time. This typically takes a bunch of phone calls to multiple parties to ensure staff is ready and it's safe to take the patient directly there. Pulsera helps eliminate all of these calls with a single tap and all team members are made aware with a push notification. Of course, any member of the care team can instantly message anyone else on the team using our team chat feature. Users can quickly select a customizable template message, free text, or even add an audio clip. Pulsera creates such a seamless situational awareness that in most cases, when EMS and the STEMI patient arrive, registration meets the patient at the door with armband and stickers ready, 
and the entire cardiovascular team is notified that the patient has arrived and is in transit directly to the cath lab. Notice how our universal clock helps keep everyone in sync throughout the duration of the case and timestamps captured along the entire patient journey simplifies reporting requirements. In fact, hospitals and EMS agencies can even sync this report with their EHR or EPCR to add the Pulsera data to the patient's record. When the case is completed, the cardiovascular team has the option of adding before and after cath images and dictating a quick summary that immediately goes back to all team members that participated in this patient's care. This real-time feedback is critical for ongoing education as well as promoting improved team dynamics. Keep in mind that while we demonstrated a case involving primarily EMS and STEMI teams, Pulsera is a communication platform that connects teams across organizations whether EMS is involved in the case or not. Hospital clinicians can also start a case for ED walk-ins, on behalf of EMS if they call in a traditional radio report, inpatients, as well as manage inter-facility transfers. Pulsera is more than just a technology solution. You can ask those we serve. It's about people, it's not just a tagline.